Hi everyone, this is Joanna. Welcome to Moonwater Tarot. And I just had a quick announcement regarding my videos. Thank you so much, first of all, for watching, subscribing, and liking and sharing. So, but what I'm gonna start doing because I usually do try to get my videos out like in a 24 to 72 hour period. But I feel like if I have them ready, why sit on them for like three days? It just doesn't make sense to me. So I'm going to be shooting them in order of how many views I'm getting in, in ratio to the thumbs up. I know some other readers are doing this too. And I've really been thinking about it. Usually I'm just pulled to do a reading but I think that obviously it's fair for those that are watching the most get those readings first. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So I just wanted to let you know that. So if you really want to see my videos, thumbs up and keep watching. All right. Thank you so much. And let's get on with the readings. And this is the weekly reading. February 29th through March 6th, 2016. All right. Thanks. Bye. All right, Libra, so these are your messages for the week. Please remember, because I am reading for thousands of you, that if this does not resonate, uh, you can watch your rising sign. And then for the overall mood uh, or emotional feeling, watch your moon sign. But I do offer private readings, and you can reach me at my website, which is moonwatertarot.com. And I also offer private video readings. So wanted you to know about that. Okay, so let me focus here for Libra for the week of February 29th through March 6th. 2016 spirit what are the messages what are the messages for libra all right let's take a look here okay libra week of february 29 what are the messages I don't know if I want to get. Okay, I think I'm going to keep that one. It was kind of like hanging there. The Three of Wands. The Seven of Cups. Wow, and the Chariot. We have two Sevens. And those. this all becomes an Eight. Okay, let's see what's underneath. This is the underlying theme. Oh, okay. So now becomes a nine. All right. Okay, let me set this up for you. Now, remember, this is the underlying theme. So very much um, movement, action, changing. Des decisions. All right, let me put this down and I'll be right back. Thanks. All right, Libra. So what I'm getting for you very much is almost like a, a regeneration. You are going through a transformation. And for some of you, this could be in to a smaller degree. And for some of you, it's to a larger degree. But as I said, without this card, this is an eight. And this is the card that was underneath the underlying theme. And so some of you are ending a cycle and beginning anew. And the eight very much speaks to movement, action, change. So I feel like some of you are definitely moving 
and some like physical move. Some of this, this is more for, for some of you, it's more a mental, emotional, a spiritual move, but it's definitely, I think that somehow you're almost looking back to decide where you want to go in the future. I'm very much focused on this rainbow. So there are choices up ahead. And I feel like you are very much growing in this week. And the choices that you make, obviously, what decisions you make in the present time influence your outcome. And there may be several choices coming in for you. And you have to decide. It's also in this, uh, in this deck, the three very much also stands for not just growth and expansion, but maybe getting someone's advice so that you make a very, I don't know, in some ways, some of you are maybe trying to get like a third opinion or an objective opinion. So you looked, you look to someone else to kind and, and, you know, they give you your options. And then you decide on how to move forward with it. So this could be very different for all of you. I mean, this could be uh, very much health related that maybe you've gotten a third opinion or you will get a third opinion in the week of February 29th. And then there, your options are laid out from you and then you choose, you move forward. Uh, for some of you, this could also be, I very much feel it in love and what direction you want to go in. And there may be many, many choices for some of you, but you're, you're just looking for the one choice or the one decision that will help you lead to this rainbow. And I'm getting that song somewhere over the rainbow. So this may even be in career. Um, and where, where is your star going to shine? I'm almost like looking at these as little star lights or stars, starry eyes. And maybe Starry Night, that song, Starry, Starry Night. Da, 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 da. Well, I'm not going to sing it because I can't sing. But anyway, um, it could even be Van Gogh, his painting, Starry Night. So maybe this has to do with, you know, because uh, I, I feel like stars are in the air. And you're trying to get clear focus. Where does your star shine most? Where are you most happy? Because if you're not happy, those around you aren't going to be happy. And I very much feel that balance is going to be very important for you. And a decision. And some of you may have a difficult time making a decision, but I do feel... That is, uh, there is a, a decision to be made for quite a few of you. And, you know, some of you may be just kind of taking like, I don't know, the week off or get a, or a weekend getaway may help gain clarity. So I feel like some of you are traveling for a little break or a little separation, kind of clear your head and, and see where you're at. So, but I definitely feel that this is a transitional opportunity for you in the week of February 29th, Libra. And especially very much important that balance that you balance the dark and the light. And I'm almost seeing like this as some of you may be waiting for a message or communication to come in. And that's going to determine what direction you go or where you move 
or where you put your energy. So, yeah, I, I feel very much that even family, family is going to have some significance, foundations, stability, and definitely love. So for some of you as with these cups here, love may very well be coming in for you. May even be a cancer sign. That's what I associate the, the chariot with. Some people associate Sagittarius. But, you know, and it's interesting, too, because I said Sagittarius, and I realized we've got the wands, which represent fire, and then we have cups, which represent water. So... All right. Well, Libra, I think it's a beautiful reading and very much transitional time um, for you. So thank you so much for watching and I wish you a beautiful week. All right. Take good care of yourself. Bye.